Yeah, that's enough. I'm, I'm a grandma. So before we get into this vlog, I want to give a big shout out to Care Of for sponsoring today's video. Care Of is a subscription service. So basically you go on their website, you do a very quick survey. I've done this survey all while being busy, either I was breastfeeding or cooking or doing something at the same time. I've done this survey multiple times. This isn't the first time I've worked with Care Of. So you do this really quick survey where they ask your name, your age, your gender, a bunch of stuff. Of course, I have a baby and he wants to be included. I also have a cat that wants to be included into the sponsorship. You do this quick survey, they ask you a bunch of easy questions, it's like less than five minutes, and then they curate a selection of vitamins for you. I have something different this time. Usually I use these. These are individually packed, which I think is great when you're on the go. Sometimes I have to leave the house. I have to drop off my son at daycare and then I don't come back home afterwards. I have stuff to do. So I just pop this in my bag with a water bottle and take these and then leave. So you can either have these. They also have like powders. Now they have these. These are very quick. So be these are basically dietary supplements this one is the pocket protector so on the go probiotic immunity there's five sticks in this or i got the gut check which i'm going to take instead and this is also a dietary supplement very quick and easy i love care of because i do feel like it makes your life a bit easier you don't have to have a bunch of like a bunch of different bottles of different vitamins in your house you just have these and they're all in here on here which i love this one says hey garcia my favorite thing is to go where i've never been diane arbus so sometimes these little quotes make me think um so yeah so thank you Kara, for sponsoring today's video if you guys are interested to signing up to care of make sure you go Make sure you guys go on TakeCareOf.com and use my discount code DARCIA50 so you can get 50% off your first order. I think it's a good thing to sign up to. Every time you get your Care Of supplement, they send you a booklet that explains everything that you got um, and why you got it, what it's going to help with. And I just feel like it's good to take care of your overall like well-being, you know? Do you agree? Do you agree? I agree. Anyways, the, everything will be linked down below for you guys. Don't forget to use my discount code DERCIA50 and we can jump right into this video. Say bye-bye. 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 Say bye-bye to... Bye-bye. Look, Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Everybody, welcome to another vlog. I look like an egg, but I do have hair. I'm back to my bun. I love wearing my bun. Um, I'm feeling, I'm in a good mood. I've had coffee, so I'm like pumped up. And today is gonna be maybe a weekend vlog, depending on if you figure out if we're going out tonight. Uh, not tonight, I mean uh, Sunday or not. But it might be a daily vlog. Like just today, spend the day with me. So I have to edit. Today, I was thinking of going to Starbucks, but I know if I go to Starbucks, I'll spend money. And I'm not trying to do that, but I really wanted like vlog something for you guys. I think I'm just gonna go to Starbucks and sit outside and like vlog or whatever while I edit because I need to finish this fashion overhaul. What else is there to do? I have to go to the grocery stores because my friends are coming over tonight. We're like, you know what? We've been spending a lot of money lately. We've been going out. I've been going through this um, sort of crisis about my life, my career choice for the past two weeks. So I haven't vlogged. I've been going out, doing things with my friends, enjoying time with my friends. And my friends are like, Darcia, this is content. And I'm like, no, I want to spend time with the people that I love without having to whip out a camera. And it was to a point where I was doing that, that every time I was out, I was like, this is content, content, content. Because you guys, a lot of you guys noticed and you guys like DM'd me and you were, you, you were guys, you guys were like, um, like, I noticed that your vlog, your, your views are going down, like, da, 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 da. And I made a decision. I will not be doing YouTube anymore. Your girl's gonna get a full-time job. No, um, I'm not gonna not do YouTube anymore. I'm kidding. I will, this channel will eventually disappear in the background. I did make a new channel. I made a new header, a new banner, a new intro that I previewed in the last vlog and probably in this vlog. I made a new channel. So I think vlogs are not going to be happening on this channel anymore and girl talks either because these are the non-sponsored videos uh videos that i don't get sponsorships for that often 
so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to keep posting like hair videos and stuff like that whatever whenever a brand is like hey let's collab or something i'll do it on this channel until like you know the other channel like gets like traction and i can get views but vlogs i would really suggest that if you're into vlogs to subscribe to the new channel which i put a lot of effort into like the whole aesthetic and i put time thinking about what type of content i want to make my content what i want to post because what i was doing is that i gained a crap ton of subscribers with the haiti vlog i i think i gained like forty thousand subscribers from the haiti vlog alone from haitians mostly haitians and that was a blessing and a curse at the same time because that video kicked my behind i made that vlog and i haven't been to haiti since so these people are like oh she's haitian i'm gonna support let me subscribe great i love you guys this is amazing amazing chef's kiss j'adore but i don't make haitian content bon. content creator qui parle creole même. i don't do that like i just thinking in creole to me is not second nature french and english bilingual baby but when it comes to put in that third language it's not a vibe and making content in creole is very hard and attracting brands in creole it's hard guys and i don't make haitian con like ha curated to the haitian community content so these forty thousand subscribers most of them i would say like out of out of forty thousand subscribers from that particular video only a thousand i think are watching my video i have taken the obviously i can't just delete them and be like you know i love them i'm very appreciative of them but um because at the same time of that video, that's when I started making a lot of haul videos. So the views were making sense. Like, YouTube was like, okay, she did that Haiti video. She's doing these hauls. So we're going to boost her hauls. And like, you know, but like, then the panoramic happened. I haven't been back to Haiti. I haven't traveled. So no one was really watching my stuff. So things that like, I'm not paid for. Or I'm not getting anything in return. Or people didn't send me stuff. Are not going to be on this channel. They're going to be on the new channel so i would suggest to subscribe if you like my vlogs my mommy content girl talks gonna be having a lot of girl talks because your girl has changed since being a mom since being a woman like i'm pushing 30 like as much as people people are acting like 30 is old like it's not it's really not old but like you're an adult like a proper you're, like between 18 and like 25 like you're a cute adult like it's cute you can still make mistakes you know, there are things that you can still, you can still, like, fuck around, you know? But no, I'm an adult, you know? And, like, I need to, like, just take things less with a grain of salt, like I used to. Like, I used to take the wrong thing seriously. And now, like, the right, now that I'm, like, confident and I'm, like, a woman and I like being a woman and blah, 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 I think there's, I've had, like, some sort of, like, existential or, like, whatever crisis going on in my head throughout the last month. Like, I didn't even want to celebrate my birthday. Like, it's to that point. Like, yeah, I planned the whole beach club thing for my birthday. But, like, my friends are like, let's go out to dinner for your birthday. And I'm like, no. No, I'm not happy with the way, like, the way I am right now. Da, 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 da. And I didn't want to. And it's sad. Like, people should want to celebrate their life. Like, it's the day you were born. So, yeah. So, I um, decided to peace out from this channel um i'm still gonna be here but not as much as i used to so with that being said i do have obligations to rand um tide locker let me turn on the lights in the apartment because i have this apartment has a lot of good lighting but at the, the same time it doesn't it don't make sense um i'm literally turning on every single light in the house i'm gonna put you guys on a tripod actually i'm gonna show show you guys let's go just let's just go in my room wow i look really cute i did my makeup and my bun i'm so happy because i had the u part wig and it was ripping off my edges um let me put you guys over here so tight locker is a brand and uh they sent me two items because last time apparently i was just like messing around right like you guys know like i'm gonna be transparent with you guys views are low money's low when my views were high your girl was designing designer it in in up like every time i found like a good price for a bag of like i like it i want it so turn this off so now that money's a little low um not money it's just i can pay my bills i can go out it's just like obviously i can buy a thousand dollar bag every time 
Um, they offered to send me two more items to show you guys. And honestly, I think this is the last time. Because I'm not like a... I'm not pro replicas. I'm not pro replicas replicas i'm gonna be honest like i'm not like yes go buy record replicas no i'm not like that i'm pro do whatever the fuck you want <laughs> do whatever you want i have 80 percent of my stuff is legit the other 20 percent 20 is it 20 Nine, yeah 20 percent the other night the other 20 percent is isn't because it's like stuff that I've, I've been sent i have four bags i think and they sent me a bag that i want to compare to the real one so you guys know this bag this is my little jacquemus I got on sale. So I got this for like 550, 550. And I've, I've been wanting the white one, but the white one is like either always sold out or the miniature one that you can literally like put in a hairpin is like $600 and I was like, no. So they had this one. And honestly, if I'm being honest, they look very very similar except that this one is slightly lighter but i think it's because the leather isn't the same kind of leather but honestly i'm very happy with this i'm still gonna wear this really cute so i will leave the discount code i can fit as much stuff as i can fit in this one i'm still gonna wear it i love this really nice it comes with the long strap it's in white i've been needing a white bag and i'm really happy with this once this one goes on sale like the real one i'll probably purchase it but uh, for now, I'm really happy with this. And I have this one. So I know that I like, like this one is slightly higher. But like, who's going to be like, your Bambino, whatever the name of this bag is, looks slightly off. Like, if you're doing that in real life, you you need to figure out more important things to do with your life. But I'm very happy with the quality. I remember when my friends first saw this while I did the fashion over haul, they were like, oh my God, this looks legit. So yeah, we're, I'm really happy with this. I love it. Wait, the strap is a bit off because it keeps sliding. But yeah, they look practically identical. So I'll leave my discount code on the screen. I love this. Then they also sent me, where's my bag? Um, They sent me these. I've been wanting these for a while. I cannot seem to find real ones at a decent price in Canada. So I got them when they said like, hey, we want to send you something else. Pick a second item. I was like, let me just pick this because I've been wanting them for my birthday. So here is the earring. Oh, I love these. They're so cute. I don't understand why everybody has them. <laughs> I love these. They're cute. So here's a close up of the earrings, guys. I think they're super cute. They're super heavy as well. Like they've not heavy, like bad heavy like they feel like good quality basically you're not paying like you're not you're not putting on some five dollar earrings on so make sure you guys use my discount code darcia dorilla so you can have ten dollars off your order with like a swimsuit or something i like them with a simple outfit like obviously you can look tacky very easily with that um with these earrings so yeah anyways i'm gonna head to starbucks i'm gonna change i'm wearing this tracksuit from pretty little thing um, from the tall section and it's really nice and simple. I would have kept it but it's really nice out and I've been wearing tracksuits all week because it was really gloomy and like raining but now I'm very happy with the weather. So I'm gonna get changed, pack my stuff and then we can head out to Starbucks, the grocery store. Bang bang. This is terrifying. Alright guys so I'm done getting ready. I'll show you guys an overview of my outfit. And like always, we're going to choose our fragrance of the day. I want to wear something that I don't usually wear. I think I'm going to go with Mushino. Mushino Fresh. Um, I'm wearing my Michael Kors men's watch. I love this watch. I always talk about this watch. I've, this used to be Bay's watch. And then he got his Apple watch and he gave me this. But I'm like, you can't go to a wedding with an Apple watch. So I'm confused. But he did buy the gold this bang whatever bangle um for the apple watch but like you can't go to a wedding with an apple watch so he's gonna have to resize this and put this on if we go to a wedding if we go to like a confusion um and i'm wearing my regular jewelry all of that put some earrings on i'm wearing this dress from pretty little thing it's a midi and it makes the body look nice and i'm gonna wear air forces just to like casual it out because I look really dressed up to go edit and like go to the grocery store and stuff. So I'm a little overdressed. Yeah, uh, the bag is this. I have 
sunglasses today are Fendi because I don't want to look too gaudy so I didn't put on uh, like designer shoes or anything because that would have been quite tacky you guys are always in my bag I'm too shy to pull up my camera at Starbucks. Actually, screw it. Hi. Um, what are your flavors of uh, refreshers, like the tea? Uh, for the tea or the, the Just the refreshers, yeah. Refreshers is strawberry, essay and mango dragon fruit. I'll get the mango dragon fruit. Does it come with like the chunks of like fruits in it it does but you can yeah can i remove them yeah sure. i'll get that with lemonade water. uh lemonade please You guys, we're going shopping. I'm at the mall. Um, I'm gonna eat something because I'm starving. And then we're gonna check out Winners. Uh, this was not a productive Starbucks thingy at all. First of all, I love Starbucks. I got a mango dragon fruit without the dragon fruit with lemonade. It's really good. But I didn't eat yet today and I was starving while I was editing. So I'm like, let me just go buy like a sandwich or whatever whatever clearly i'm in 2050 because why do they only take cash but i managed to buy this with my debit and then like oh no we take cash only when i went back to get food so i guess their, their machine was like broken so i'm like i'm not about to starve over here so i just left i'm annoyed because i'm hungry i know it's not their fault but like i was hungry and i really needed to edit this video but i have until monday which is fine i'm, I'm almost done it's just i was hungry i was i'm taking a goo so i left all right so i got obviously i got poulet rouge because that's the only thing i seem to eat when i go to the mall i didn't get anything to drink because i still have this and i get the barbecue fusion bowl i'm not really a fan of like burning my intestines to a crisp that's more Bay's situation that's what he likes so yeah so this is what i got look how beautiful this is <laughs> wow wow if you know you know if you come to montreal you have to try poulet rouge you will not be disappointed it's so yummy So we are currently at the grocery store. Um, I don't know what I want to make. I don't know if I want to make like veggies and like mashed potatoes and like meat. Or just pasta, like shrimp pasta. And I have to pull out some chicken. Actually, I forgot to pull out the chicken. I would have made chicken pasta for Sibyl because Sibyl don't eat. She doesn't eat seafood, which is very questionable for me i'm annoyed i don't know what to make it's also really hot like i don't know where this weather came from i hate this country because i be leaving the house with a jacket and like fully clothes and then by the end of the day i just want to be butt naked um bang bang lucky look bang 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 I really want to buy myself some flowers because that was my plan for the summer. But Bay has been roasting me so much. He's like literally every single alive thing that you've bought, you've killed. Besides my son and my cat. And he didn't even buy me my buy, I didn't even buy my cat. He bought it for me. And well, you know how babies work, so. I'm annoyed. I really want to buy flowers, but he's right. I've been killing every single bouquet of flowers that I've brought home. And it's quite embarrassing. 
Okay, so I have broccoli. The only thing is, is that I wish that this supermarket had the, I wish they had like the long broccoli. <laughs> How do you explain that? Like the really long ones, like the that you get at like the Asian restaurants. I have potatoes, so the potatoes are fine. Now we're gonna have to go to the meat. And my friends. Okay, let me. I need it. I need um grenadine syrup. I have a friend that's pregnant, so I'm gonna get her this because I really like this when I was pregnant. And the grape one, they were really good. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm vlogging and I'm not even shy. Here, you go, girl. Um, yeah, I got that when I was pregnant. So one of them is pregnant and she might come. I don't even know if she's coming. But um, at, least, at least I'll have it at my house for her. Hi, Heidi. Um, her baby shower soon, too. These are like all of my like intrus intrusive thoughts, you guys would not believe how much I have to edit out of a video because your girl I, I think I might have ADHD honestly if I'm being really transparent with you guys the way I speak the way like I listen I don't like my it feels like my brain's going a thousand miles per hour okay I can make this for them please this is $50 I love y'all but like come on look who's home look who's home He's kind of hungry, so giving him a snack. These are Mum Mums uh, plant-based pea chips. I accidentally bought them. These say two year old and plus. I, I, I bought them thinking that like it was age appropriate for him, but he seems to, actually Attila was, I've been told that Attila's a really good eater for his age, like solid, so he eats them just fine. At daycare, like, he, exactly. <laughs> He eats really well, like he eats like a proper like toddler. But you only one! You only one! You only one! You're a big boy. You want water? You want cheese? Yeah? Cheese? Okay, I'll give you cheese. No, 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 last night because we got way too lit at my place and like we were just so deep into our conversations like we went from like talking about like past traumas and like failed friendships to like people from high school like oh this person you know like did you know this person started this business or that or like um what else to us talking about business it was we were like just all over the place and i just didn't put it put a, um pull up my camera so today i woke up we went to bed at like three we woke up at like no we went to bed at like 3 a.m and then we woke up at like 7 30 because obviously we have a child and then um i went back to bed at 11 with my child with attila to nap and we napped together till like three and then I got ready and then we ran to the mall because Bath and Body Works has these semi annual So I'm at my parents' house because Lil lives right next to my parents' house. And we're going to like this festival thingy with like art and stuff. So I'm taking you guys with me. Um, and there's like food and it's on Saint Laurent. And Saint Laurent is like, like a super hyped street in Montreal, like where the clubs are and stuff like that. So it's a vibe. So I went to Bath and Body Works for the semi annual so that's happening. And I had a, a, a coupon that was expiring tomorrow. So I had to go. To the sale today because i don't think i have time to go tomorrow so i picked up a few things i'm like over spending like a crap ton of money at bath and body works like i used to buy like five bottles of like body lotion and then five bottles of like freaking body mist and this is and no i'm gonna buy the stuff that like i'm gonna i know i use because i just use regular like vaseline cocoa 
moisturizer you know like i'm not gonna put on a bunch of different moisturizers every day so i got three candles i got the orange pineapple punch great summer scent yummy 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 then i got the pink shores when i saw it i was like oh my god look at the packaging it's so cute so hopefully it smells good and i smelled it and it smells pretty good it's not as good as like other candles but it's pretty good when it comes with like a nice packaging then this one mahogany coconut it's not really my vibe but like it is at the same time because i'm a coconut type of person so yeah um so i got that and then i got these three plugins because i'm not always like burning candles um sunny tropical mangoes these are like the uh wallflower recharges champagne toast and fresh orange nice summer scent and then raspberry and whipped vanilla and yeah so my outfit today is this top from h&m i got it a while ago i got it a while ago and it's like 15 bucks and these are like the types of tops i love wearing with palazzo pants and you guessed it today i'm wearing palazzo pants um i'm wearing these wide leg orange palazzo pants from boohoo boohoo earrings i'll try to link this these as well these are like twisty earrings sunglasses are fendi hair is in a bun tried to put this piece but it keeps sticking out so whatever um did my everyday makeup routine and i'm wearing the yakimus <laughs> today and yeah so and i'm matching with titi so i'll link i'll just insert a clip of my full outfit and my fragrance is tom ford soleil blanc today so hi you are so handsome look who's here <laughs> Until I'm staring right at her. He's like, what are you doing? So one shot of vodka. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shot. No shot. Yeah, that's enough. I'm I'm a grandma. Okay. I got guys, they have like new flavors of like candy. So cute. So this is like a sour pineapple. And these are mango rings. Y'all know my Haitian ass had to get the ma the mango flavored candy. Mm, I'm so excited. Problem with the menu.